We're 3.9 kilometers below South Africa, inside the world's deepest mine. No person has ever ventured deeper than this point. We've reached the frontier of human exploration. Intense heat makes it impossible to travel farther. The rock face is at least 60 degrees, hot enough to burn the skin from our fingers. The weight of nearly four kilometers of solid rock above brings a constant risk of collapse. But it's worth the risk. The rock looks unremarkable. But it's hiding something spectacular. Two point eight billion years ago, hot water trapped inside the Earth since the planet's formation cracked the rock. The water released microscopic mineral particles. They formed a vein of quartz, and in it, gold. This is real-life alchemy. Gold has captivated mankind for millennia. It won't tarnish, discolor, or crumble. It's exceptionally malleable. A single ounce of gold can be beaten to a sheet 90 meters square. And above all, it's beautiful. Every gram of gold, even the gold in your wedding ring, started life billions of years ago, far from Earth in an exploding star. In a supernova, an explosion so intense, it fused atoms into gold. Microscopic gold particles blasted out into space, mixed with rocks and dust, to form our planet. It's this gold dust we mine today, nearly four kilometers down. In this mine, most of the gold is scattered throughout the rocks. One ton of rock will yield less than a sugar cube of gold. There's something else hidden in these crevices. Tiny, mysterious organisms. Microbes. This is some of the deepest life ever found on land. With no sun, no oxygen or nutrients, these microbes eat rock. And they've got company. These monsters are worms, nicknamed devil worms. 